Today we're going to be working on this golf cart. This golf cart had all these six volt batteries in it. And we're going to try something the internet says probably not to do. But we're going to put 12 volt marine batteries in it and see what we can get done out of it. First thing we're going to do is we're going to clean all this up and vacuum all of this and get it cleaned up. So we'll have a good fresh working area. Now that we got it clean, we're going to try to figure out how we're going to place them in there. Let's get the first one in. Let's see. I'm going to be able to put it somewhere about like that right there. Oh, it's getting in there tight. <clears throat> Let's do this one here. And then, down there, that ought to work. We'll just cross them, cross them, and then, actually, this will go to here, and then this one to here, and then this one to the battery. And the negative will hook up right here. So that'll work out good. These should, old ones, these old ones will fit right on there. Absolutely. Yeah, they, they only added uh, yeah. one on most of them. Were, uh, they added that on them. Cool. All right. What I'm doing here is I got two big pieces that I'm going to join together right here. I'm going to try to spread a little bit of that out. I'm going to put some flux in them, which is going to help it. It'll help it uh, adhere better to the solder. So I'm gonna put a little bit in each one, kind of use each other to brush it in there a little bit. This is gonna help it. Now I'm gonna kind of stick them together a little bit like so, and I'm gonna take this, and I'm gonna kinda pinch it and wrap it. That's gonna help keep it together. This is just an old piece of wire that I had in the shop that I'm using here. And don't worry if it sticks off the edge of it or if it comes out, it ain't gonna hurt anything because you're going to cut it off anyway. So once you got it done like that, you want to take your brush, you're going to cover it. And don't forget to put your heat shrink on first before you do this. It's probably going to take all of this little piece of solder that I got right here. But if it does, it does. this is going to make a good connection and if you have to splice it to, m to me it's always better to splice with solder and this is a big connection so it's probably going to take a little bit of heat going on my solder's stuck on this side a little bit ain't hot enough gonna have to get it hotter Solder goes 
a good connection. It's good and soldered now. I thought it was, but I wanted to be sure it's gonna be hot. I know that. All right. I'm gonna put this on there like this right here. We're gonna crank up the heat. I'm gonna put some solder down in it. I'm gonna watch it melt. Basically, we're just filling this thing up like a bowl. You don't want to overfill it, but you don't want to underfill it either. And it's getting really, really hot. Okay, that's probably going to be enough right there. We just turn it off. And that's a good connection there. Just don't let it hit you in the leg. <laughs> this is going to be hot. All right, now we got everything hooked back up. Everything is connected, which this is our main positive over here. And then our negative over here. It goes over here to our charge cable. This is our light, so it's just hooked up to 12 volts. So you just run it across one battery and you get 12 volts. And we also added this switch here for the lights. And uh, we also added this gauge right here. So when you turn it on, it tells how much battery power we have. And then turn it off, it goes away. So we're going to plug the charger in now and check it out. All right, we got everything together. We're going to put the seat back on. And we'll let the seat down. And let's test it out. Go ahead, Pop. I'm going to let you flip this one over. <laughs> well. Seems like it's working just fine. On a conversion to 12-volt batteries instead of 6-volt batteries. We checked it, made sure it charged. Everything charges like it's supposed to and runs like it's supposed to. So we're gonna test it out. We will update.